Firefighters in Texas are still desperately trying to control what has become the largest wildfire in state history. As of Sunday night, the Smokehouse Creek fire had burned more than 1 million acres across the Texas panhandle. In a few weeks, we'll really know what we've lost. Warm temperatures and dry grass fueled the blaze over the weekend, but crews could be getting a break from the critical fire weather on Monday. Forecasters say cooler weather and a change in wind patterns will sweep across the state, which could help containment. If you see a column or you see a clouds of smoke, call that in. That we that is a fire. Since this fire ignited last week, emergency officials estimate hundreds of structures have been destroyed. The impact especially felt by ranchers who say they've lost cattle, barns and feed supplies. And we're going to have lost by 200 to 250 head uh, and that's just cows. I've spent the last 15 years building this cow herd up and uh, you can lose it overnight. Just miles away, firefighters also working to contain the Roughneck Fire, which has burned hundreds of acres so far. Air tankers and ground resources have been responding to flare-ups. We're going to seek out some of those heats uh, that are detected by the infrared flights and we're going to be ready for additional flare-ups as they occur. State officials expect the number of damaged structures to only grow as assessment of the damage continues. That's the latest from Dallas. Casey Stiegel, Fox News.